name is Jimbo and I am an animal cell. Welcome to the exciting world of mitosis. Right now, you see me in interphase. Interphase is the period of cell growth. This is where I grow up to be a big, strong cell. I spend more than 90% of my life in this phase right here. In this phase, my DNA, the stuff that makes me who I am, is in my nucleus in the form of chromatin, which means it is coiled up like spaghetti. I have two pairs of centrosomes made out of my cytoskeleton, which helps me to hold my shape. These will be important later. My nuclear envelope, which holds my brains in, is completely intact. Inside my nucleus, during interphase, my DNA is slowly duplicated. And I have my nucleolus intact. My nucleolus is used to make ribosomes, which make protein for me to live on. That is interphase. The first stage of mitosis is prophase, which can be divided into two parts, early and late. In early prophase, my chromatin fibers coil up, becoming the beginnings of chromosomes. Chromosomes form two identical pairs, shaped like butterflies with tiny waists called centromeres. From my centrosomes, which have spread to opposite sides of the cell, mitotic spindles, formed out of the very cytoskeleton that holds me together, have grown. And that marks the end of early prophase. Now I am entering the late stage of prophase. In this phase, my nuclear envelope the envelope that normally holds my brains in breaks up entirely. Spindles, which have formed from my centromeres, reach out for my chromosomes, snatching onto tiny protein structures at their centers. Other spindles hold hands with spindles from opposite poles. And chromosomes are pushed toward the center. And that marks the end of the late prophase. The next phase, metaphase, is one of my most important phases. Now we enter my second stage, metaphase. The spindle is now fully formed. Chromosomes line up end to end in the middle of the cell, the same distance from both poles. The spindle microtubules attach to different sides of the chromosomes, each tugging at the sister chromatids to pull them toward the poles. In a phase, my third phase, begins suddenly when chromosomes are split in half to form sister chromatids. Microtubules which sprouted from my centrosomes in prophase, pull the sister chromatids to opposite sides of the cell by shortening themselves. Unattached microtubules, like this one here, lengthen, pushing the cell apart into an oval shape. Telophase is my fourth and final phase. It begins when the sister chromatids reach the opposite poles of the cell. My chromosomes uncoil as a new nuclear envelope forms around them. The spindle, which came from my centrosomes, dissolves. Two genetically identical nuclei now exist. Now begins cytokinesis, the division of the cytoplasm. It begins with a cleavage furrow, a dent in my cell wall that deepens and pinches the cell apart, making two new cells.